Yo, what's going on everyone? It's Flame Fox here. In this video, I'm going to tell you guys the best Prodigy starter pet in 2021 because they do usually change it or they changed it once. I don't know. But before that, as you can see right here, subscribe to my brother's channel. He's been grinding it with Prodigy, the daily uploads. So make sure to subscribe to him. And let's cut right to the chase. First bet, Charfo right here, 8,798 max health. Mermina, 11,628 max health. Sprout with the whopping 10,400 max health. And Wall with the 9,303. And lastly, you already know your boy Snowfluff with the 10,977 max health. Now, it's not really fair to just like base them on max health as there are a lot of other factors you need to consider. One of those factors is the spells as well as what elements the pets, the starter pets are weak and strong against. So yeah, there's also some other information here like how much hearts they gain for level. Doesn't really affect it too much. But if we base it on strengths and weaknesses, Charful, I think he has lead. He's only weak against water and shadow, and everyone is weak against water. A huge strong against earth, ice, and fire. Oh, wow, what a prodigy pro. And he is neutral against storm and astral. Now, Mermina not looking too good, except she does have the max health, or he, I don't know. Uh, as you can see right here, he's weak against earth, storm, and shadow. And is only strong as fire and water. But the thing is, most pets are fire and water type, or most that people have, because people tend to like those. So it could be kind of an advantage. Alright, but we move on to Sprout. He's weak against two and strong against two. So he's alright. Neutral against three. Uh did I say what? I meant Sprout. And as you can see, Walt right here, absolutely terrible. Only strongest one, weak against three, and neutral against three. And Snowfluff, he is weak against two, strong against one, and neutral against these four. Not that good either. But guys, the worst pet in all of Prodigy is Drumroll. I don't have Drumroll, I edit these live. But it is what, as you can see right here, absolutely terrible. Starting off, look at that health. Like, what is that? Come on, man. Like, what? You're only gonna rock 9,303. Like, these others are rocking sub above 10,000. <laughs> sub is under. They're rocking more than 10,000 health. And he's coming in here with his measly 9,303 health. Not even counting, he's weak against three types and only strong against one. So listen to me, please do not choose Watt. Like, I'm doing you guys a favor. I'm sorry to all the Watt fans, but he's terrible. And for the best pet, I'm actually going to give it to Charful. I, I was kind of debating whether giving it to like um this one or this one because they're pretty good as well even snow fluff he's actually pre pretty decent like considering it's a lot to scroll up but considering his max health is a lot but you know charful does have that versatility as you can see right here um their max health not that great it, it's <laughs> it's it's worse than what i know but what makes charful good it is strong against three elements, guys. That's so hard to find. Actually, it's not that hard to find. I lied. It's actually pretty easy to find. But this pet is very versatile. Being strong to three elements, that's going to help you so much. Because a lot of people rock earth, ice, and fire. So if you're fighting someone, especially if you do firefly forest first, charful, it's a fire type. It's going to be strong against the earth. And when you're done, the first firefly. There's only one firefly forest. What am I saying? But when you are done firefly forest and want to move on to others or have enough pets, 
you can just swap him out and he would have given you a good head start to beat the boss do everything very versatile strong against a lot of things only weak against water and shadow and everything is weak against shadow except shadow i think there is also base health which mermina would take the lead with 560 charfo 423 and uh sprout 500 watt 448 snow fluff 529 so 560 is pretty high and Mermina is a very good second choice. I only chose Charfo because of the types he is strong against. He's basically overpowered like being strong against three types. But if you don't like Charfo because you don't like how he looks, definitely go for Mermina. She's strong against two types and weak against three. But the max health is crazy and she looks pretty cool. Like, look at that, looks pretty sick. But that is it for this video, guys. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.